So I have some friends that are having trouble focusing. They need a little bit more structure in terms of what they have access to. Of course, our devices are uh, set up so that we want to be distracted. So how do we help structure that a little bit more? So here I am in HAPRA, and instead of being on the dashboard, which is the default view here for my training class one, I'm gonna go over here to highlights. And highlights is essentially a way that I can keep an eye on what students are doing. So the default tab is this br uh, browser tab. So I can see these students aren't connected, but look, there are there's those uh, students are right here. I can also go to sort and I can sort by who's online because I know these are the students that I want to support. So immediately I can see what they're what they're uh, looking at and I can tell by the bold here that why we need to talk about race is uh, what this student is looking at and this student is looking about um, information about among us. All right so how do I help these students stay a little bit more focused? So, um, so in this case, I can click on this and I can see exactly what they're working on. And so I can do that for any of these tabs, or I can click to this current screens, which takes a screenshot every few seconds uh, of exactly what the students are looking at. So uh, again, I can see this one, this one, and this is clearly the student is on a Google Meet. All right, so how do I help students uh, make different decisions or help scaffold their learning. So I'm going to go over here to guide browsing and basically guide browsing allows me two different choices. I can set up a focus session or I can set up a filter session. A focus session allows only the websites I tell the students to be able to go to. Those are the only things they'll be able to access here. And in a filter session, it's they can't go to the sites that I that I say. So maybe my student has some issues with uh, being on Hangouts where they should be in class. So I'm going to do hangouts.google.com. And I'm also going to block out their uh, mailbox so, so they can't go to Gmail either. Oh, it doesn't like that. Let's go mail.google.com and see what happens. OK, so now this is going to stop students from being able to use their mail or for Hangouts. And again, I'm going to do it for particular students, the ones that I know that have the concern around Hangouts. OK, and I'm going to make it for 15 minutes or maybe the horse course of the whole day. And I can schedule this for later and I can also save it as a template. If I know something that I'm going to use it often, um, I can save it as a template. So. Um, so as I start my student, so there I go, uh, start my session. Uh, again, it's going to give me the countdown. And on my student view, hangouts.google.com. There I am, hangouts.google.com. Again, it's not letting me get there. And similarly, if I went to gmail.com, again, it's not going to let me. And again, trying to help me organize myself and make the right decisions around my learning. So when I am ready, I can release all students and then they can have access to whatever they want. Okay. So alternatively, so I can now um, uh, immediately for a particular student, I can start a focus session, which and so the focus session allows me to only put in the information that they need. So, um, so student my student dashboard, I use uh, docs or drive.google.com because that gives them access to the documents that are in my student dashboard. All right. And so I can say the whole sites, which means that um, I can only so make it so they can navigate along those sites or I can have only the pages. So they only see the head page. So um, that means like if I only want them to see one YouTube uh, link and that is it, I can have it just that one page. Okay. And again, it's just for student 12. So it's not going to affect the whole class. And then I can start the session. So again, it gives me a countdown. All right, and then here on the student ver version, I can see that uh, students, we're going to get a focus session, will begin shortly, and it's telling me who's doing it, and wango bango, there are the three tabs that I have forced open for this student. So here I can go to 